If you're an NI application engineer, if you want to take your application and deploy it over the edge, can be a car, can be a robot, can be a smart city situation, can be in uh, agriculture. Everything, everything or every place that either have low bandwidth or high demands for uh, security and privacy, you should consider Halo 4. Hello iPixers, we are at Embedded World 2025 with Nadav from Halo. Mm -hmm. Tell us all about Halo, what you do and why they should know about you. Yes, certainly. So uh, Halo is the uh, Edge AI company that uh, brings the best um, AI performance at the edge. Um, I'm managing the customer success and application engineering team at Halo over, for the past uh, five years. Um, we're based out of Tel Aviv, but we are spread worldwide. Uh, why you should know about Halo? Uh, if you're an NI application engineer, if you want to take your application and deploy it over the edge, can be a car, can be a robot, can be a smart city situation, can be in uh, agriculture. Everything, everything or every place that either have low bandwidth or high demands for uh, security and privacy, you should consider Halo 4. So, Nadav, tell us about what the community IP Exchange can buy from Halo. Yes, definitely. So we have um, two main uh, product lines that we are currently uh, av available on the market. We have our current uh, offering of the Halo 8. This is our co-processor. Uh, it, right. can, it can sit next to basically any processor, be it an IMX, a Raspberry Pi, an Intel, an AMD, an FPJ. Whatever you, you want to have, you can uh, put this one next to it and it will do all the neural processing. Um, and we also have a VPU. Uh, this uh, small guy is uh, designed to be uh, the brains and the heart of a smart camera. So this guy... So this one's a smart camera? The brains of it. It does right. everything. It does the uh, image processing, the DSP, the ISP, um, the neural processing, of course, uh, generic uh, CPU. It does everything. The only thing that you need to take care, of, take care of is the application that you want to run on the camera. Right, right. So that's that. And then tell us about that one there. Yeah, so this is, uh, this is the Halo 8 in, a, in an M.2 form factor. We have different form factors. Um, for you know, um, bigger projects, people might, might want to do a chip down design. Right. So we can sell also the chip it itself. Uh, in a Raspberry uh, situation, for example, we have a dedicated Raspberry hat that you can couple with the R5. This one is a very popular door. Um, and we also have um, other uh, m 2 form factors right. available. So when you come to Embedded World and you show this very, very clever silicon, mm -hmm. what's, the most, what's the most frequently asked question that you get when you come onto the booth? When somebody says, this is the problem that I'm trying to solve, what's the most frequently asked question that you get asked mm -hmm. and the problems that you solve? Yes, so people just want to ask, how can I get it as soon as, I, as, soon as possible to my desk? And fortunately enough, we have and I have many options these days with the Raspberry Pi, with some of our other partners um, like uh, like EBV, like Solid Run, that uh, you can take basically similar silicon in different form factors, whatever yep. makes most sense to you, to your use case, yep. to your environment uh, situation, uh, and you can start develop. Our uh, software is completely open, so even before you get the actual uh, hardware, you can start looking at our GitHub, see the examples, see the different models, get to know our runtime environment. This is very convenient. Excellent. And what's going on here? This is a demo that is coming from one of our partners, Perceive AI. This is a, a Dutch uh, software company. And basically what they've done, they've taken the Raspberry Pi plus the Halo, and they're um, making perception based on radar uh, sensor. Oh, OK. So we see here how the radar uh, falls onto the scene. And the perception understanding, the drivable space, the different objects, Everything is being computed uh, and inferenced on the Halo device. This, um, this visual uh, point is only for the reference. It's not part of what the system actually sees. It's only for the... Uh, so you can see that that is representing that. It's just exactly, so that, yeah, exactly. okay. And here up here, we can see uh, a sort of a heat map of the road. So right. kind of a bird eye view of what's happening in the scene. Yeah. 
And the good thing about it, this is a very standard platform. It's not something yeah, 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 high-end. No, it's not no, that. no, that's something that you can go and get wherever and from any very... Sim so you're getting some very, very high-end compute here mm -hmm. of seeing what's going on. Mm -hmm. So where are they from? From the Netherlands. They're Dutch. But they're Dutch? Yeah. Right, okay. Very, very good. Mm -hmm. So this is a typical ap application of the kind of thing that you would do with your technology? Yes, definitely. I think that's a very good introduction. Thank you very much.